There's an alligator under my bed. Written and illustrated by Mercer Mayer. We bought this book for Colby because he loved the book about the nightmare in his closet when he was little. There used to be an alligator under my bed. When it was time to go to sleep, I had to be very careful. He's climbing up the board to get to his bed because he doesn't want to walk near his bed. Because I knew he was there. But whenever I looked, he hid or something. So I call mom and dad. I see him. He's right there. But they never saw it. It was up to me. I just had to do something about that alligator. So I went to the kitchen to get some alligator bait. I filled the paper bag full of things alligators like to eat. What does he have? I see bananas and carrots, grapes, celery, and a box of something that might be crackers or might be cereal. And I see an orange. I put a peanut butter sandwich, some fruit, and the last piece of pie in the garage. I put cookies down the hall. I left fresh vegetables on the stairs. I put a soda and some candy next to my bed. Then I watched and waited. Sure enough, out he came to get something to eat. Then I hid in the hall closet. I followed him down the stairs. I followed him down the hall. When he crawled into the garage, I slammed the door and locked it. Then I went to bed. There wasn't even any mess to clean up. Now that there is an alligator in the garage, I wonder if my dad will have any trouble getting in his car tomorrow morning. I'll just leave him a note. And there's a picture of an alligator. Dear dad, there's an alligator in the garage. He spelled it wrong, cross it out. Garage, if you need help, wake me up. Warning, be careful. There's an alligator under my bed.